Oh my god. Okay, I look a mess and everything. Just don't mind that. But that is not the point of this video, y'all. Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Ori, and I'm back with another video. Can't believe I made it. Used to wake up, get faded. This Hollywood shit was foreign to me, like I just hopped off the slave ship. These niggas signing two million dollars, three sixty deals, getting on some slave shit. Popped out on the opposite, the Glock in my hand, like fuck it, I was on some brave shit. Me and Lil Pro hop out, blaze. You know what? Let me just let me just get into it because yes, I'm so excited. I haven't did a video in so long. I'm sorry, I've been waiting. I know, I know. But yeah, so I'm gonna just get straight into it. I don't have no notes on any or anything on how I did it, but I'm gonna just tell y'all from what comes to my head. So. The first thing, like the most important thing that I did, the most important thing I think to growing your hair is to keeping your is keeping your hair moisturized. So how I did that personally was maybe like every two days or every day if I could, I would well if this was if my hair wasn't in like a protective style like with braids or something like that. Even if I had a bun in my hair. I would um, take water and conditioner in a spray bottle. I will show y'all my spray bottle right now. It does not need to be a fancy spray bottle. This is the spray bottle I have. It just got water in it right now. I don't know what's in it. There's soap in it right now. Don't know why. Don't know how I got there. But yeah, so I just put like some water in it. About this much water or this much water. And then I just like put maybe like five. Bro, stop it. Maybe like five um, squirts of conditioner in there. So yeah, I just mix that up and then I spray my hair with it. That keeps my hair moisturized, it keeps it soft. Even when like the water and conditioner dries, you can like feel the difference in your hair. Cause um, when your hair is dry, it breaks off. And that's how, um, that's the, that's one of the reasons you, if you don't see um, growth in your hair is because your hair is breaking off. That's mostly the reason why. Because everybody's hair grows, like no matter what your hair was growing, some grows slower than others, some grow, grow some people's hair grows faster than others so your hair is always growing but the ends is what matters if you're keeping your ends healthy they won't break off and you'll see the um the um, difference in the length of your hair but so the first thing is keeping your hair moisturized and that's one of the ways i did that other ways is when i wash my hair and condition it i do it regularly wash it with shampoo rinse it out and i don't put shampoo on the ends of my hair unless i have like unless i put a lot of gel in my hair or whatever or unless i take my hair out of braids that i had in for a while that's when i scrub my ends and like all my hair but i just let the shampoo rinse out rinse through my hair i don't put it on my ends because that can dry out your hair that's a part of keeping your hair moisturized don't do that i mean especially for people with curly hair because um some people i know people all wash their hair differently but this is just what i did i'm just letting y'all know what i did so yeah and then when i condition my hair i don't put it in my scalp i don't put it on my scalp that's gonna make your hair greasy unless you have really dry scalp i mean you could try it i never tried it i don't want to scrub my hair scrub my hair with like conditioner on my scalp i don't want to do that but i usually just put it like on all of my hair not my scalp but all of my hair especially the ends you make sure you get the ends real good and then i let it sit in my hair while like while i take the rest of my shower so it's basically like a short deep conditioner so basically every time i wash my hair i deep condition my hair kind of sort of because you know i'm letting it sit in so yeah that's another thing i did to keep my hair moisturized and then when it's time to rinse out the conditioner um i didn't all i never like i never rinse it all the way out i just like rinse it a couple times and make sure there's still some still some in there um mostly because i don't have a leave-in conditioner so i use um i use conditioner as my leave-in conditioner so i just let that sit in my hair so yeah that's one of the things and yeah that's pretty much mostly the things i did okay so now i hope y'all understand what i'm saying if not just ask questions down below if you don't get what i'm saying ask questions down below why did i say that two times so, i don't know but yeah comment down below if you have any questions i respond to every comment i respond to every comment if you ask questions so yeah now another thing i recommend to growing your hair or what i did to grow my hair was when i started this process 
um i started i started this process when i got my hair flat iron the last time i got my hair flat iron this was three months of growth so the thumbnail picture was three months of growth for me it took me three months to grow about two inches i think that was two inches or an inch and a half at least so yeah it took me three months for that and i started off with my hair being straight just how it is now i started off with it being straight and it was around this length around this length and when i started i had got my hair trimmed i didn't get it cut i got it trimmed so if you want to start growing your hair i recommend you to get your ends clipped so you can start fresh they don't take off like this much they take off like maybe like a half an inch even less sometimes most of the time it's even less you can you can tell them how much you want them to cut off depending on the, the, depending on who you go to so yeah okay so i recommend starting off with you getting your ends clipped because split ends when you have split ends they'll just keep splitting and splitting and splitting and then your hair is just going to eventually break off and that's how that's mostly the reason you don't see growth because your ends break off i think i said that earlier but yeah getting a trim will prevent the split ends from keep splitting up 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 and then you won't have no hair and you're gonna be bald headed so i recommend getting a trim real quick if you don't see your hair growing period so yeah that's mostly all i did and the last thing i did for like this is the last thing i really actually remember doing that i feel like helped me grow my hair was whenever i had like a bun in my hair whenever i had a bun in my hair or whenever i had braids or whenever i had like any hairstyle no matter what unless it was like this unless it's like this unless it's straight even when i have my um uh my curly hair out i always have some like some sort of oil and dif and there's different oils um not every oil goes well with people's hair some people are allergic to certain oils uh so do y'all research on that but i used um coconut oil i used some shea moisture oils um whatever oils they really ha they had i just look at the ingredients if it got like coconut oil neem oil olive oil like if it has like all those oils i just use it but when i say use it i mean um if my hair feels dry and i don't have my water and conditioner that's when i put oil in my hair just to protect my ends to protect my ends from uh, breaking off or whatever because that's one thing that protects your ends too if you put oil on it it's um that helps with less breakage so your hair won't break off as much so yeah i'm going to continue doing i don't know why my door keeps making noise but we're not going to speak on it but i'm going to continue doing all those things i just told y'all i'm sorry because i know I, I was just talking a lot this whole time but what i what i was saying was making sense in my head and once again if it didn't make sense to y'all just comment down below questions you have but this is all the stuff i did y'all probably think i did a lot of extra stuff no i really didn't and also one more thing when i had braids in my hair like box braids or any type of braids i used wild growth oil the white bottle and i just put it in my hair on my scalp massaged it in and sometimes i give myself scalp massages so i don't know um i don't know if those work but that's what i did so yeah that's all the things i did i'm gonna continue doing them and in maybe like a couple months i'll update y'all on the length of my hair because i think maybe today later or tomorrow i'm going to wash my hair because i'm tired of having straight hair now i miss my curls so much so very much so very much but yeah i'm gonna continue doing that and update y'all and i'll be in a couple months maybe like three months and i talk a lot so i'm just gonna stop here thank you for thank y'all for watching this video subscribe to my channel if you have not and comment down below video ideas y'all want to see from me and watch my other videos if you haven't because period especially watch my first video that i ever made that was so funny that was the funniest video ever but yeah <laughs> If y'all got this far, I love you. Thank you so much for supporting me and everything. Hit that like button if you liked it. If you didn't like it, don't like it or dislike it. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Whatever, baby. Period. <laughs> yep, it's time for me to end this video because now I'm about to start having anxiety. Bye, y'all. Love y'all.